ஹாய் எல்லாருக்கும் வணக்கம் ஸோ குட் ஈவினிங் டு ஆல் இந்த கொரோனா கோவிட் நைன்டீன் சமயத்தில் எல்லாருக்கும் நிறைய சர்ச்சைகள் போயிட்டுருக்கு எஸ்பெஷலி இந்த கால் டு வை த சர்ச்சஸ் ஆர் நாட் ஓப்பன் போயிட்டெல்லாம் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா நிறைய செக்ஷன்ஸ் வந்துட்டுருக்கு ஈவன் த பிஷப்ஸ் கூட தே தேர் டிசைடிங் டு ஓப்பன் த சர்ச்சஸ் பிகாஸ் பீப்புள் லமெண்ட் த சர்ச்சஸ் ஆர் க்ளோஸ்ட் தேர் இஸ் நோ லிட்டர்ஜி தேர் இஸ் நோ செரிமனி அண்ட் ஆல் இந்த சமயத்தில் ஐ வாண்ட் டு ரீட் லெட்டர் ஃப்ரம் சென்ட் ஜஸ்ட் இந்த மாட்டியர் இந்த டிஃபென்ஸ் ஆஃப் கிறிஸ்டின்ஸ் ஸோ இது வந்து நிற்கிறக்கூடிய இந்த காலகட்டத்தில் இட் இஸ் வெரி ஆக்ட் இன்றைக்கி லிட்டர்ஜியை பற்றி நம்ம புரிஞ்சுக்கிறதுக்கும் இன்றைக்கி சர்ச்சஸில் நம்ம போயிட்டு கம்யூனிட் வாங்க முடியல மாஸ் அட்டன் பண்ண முடியல அப்படின்னு சொல்லி எல்லாம் ரொம்ப ஃபீல் பண்ணிக்கிட்டு இருக்க நேரத்தில் ஹவு அவர் ஏர்லி கிறிஸ்டின்ஸ் லீவ் ரீசன்ட் லார்டு மேலே இந்த ஃபெய்த் வந்து எப்படி அவங்க வாழ்ந்தாங்க அப்படின்றதுக்கான ஒரு பேசிக்காக வந்து இந்த ஒரு லெட்டர் சென்ட் ஜஸ்ட் இந்த மாட்டியர் இருந்தது But uh, this letter is in English, so I read it in English. Maybe you can find the translations in, uh, in Google. Reading from the first apology of Justin Martyr in defense of the Christians. No one may share in the Eucharist except those who believe in the truth of our teachings and have been washed in the path which confers forgiveness of sins and rebirth and who live according to Christ's commands. For we do not receive this food as ordinary bread and as ordinary drink, but just as Jesus Christ our Savior become flesh through the word of God and assumed flesh and blood for our salvation, so too we are taught that the food over which the prayer of thanksgiving, the word received from Christ, has been said, the food which nourishes our flesh and blood by assimilation is the flesh and blood of this Jesus who became flesh. The apostles in their memoirs, which are called Gospels, recorded that Jesus left them these instructions. He took bread, pronounced the prayer of thanksgiving and said, Do this in memorial of me. This is my body. In the same way he took the cup, announced the prayer of thanksgiving and said this is my blood and shared it among them and no one else from that time on we have always continued to remind one another of this those of us who are well provided help out any who are in need and we meet together continually over all our offerings we give thanks to the creator of all through his son jesus christ and the holy spirit on sundays there is an assembly of all who live in towns or in the country and the memoirs of the apostles or the writings of the prophets are read for as long as time allows then the reading is brought to the end and the president delivers an address in which he admonishes and encourages to imitate in our own lives the beautiful lessons we have heard and read then we all stand up together and pray when we have finished the prayer as i have said bread and wine and water or brought up the president offers prayers and thanksgiving as best he can and the people say amen as an expression of their agreement then follows the distribution of the food over which the prayer of thanksgiving has been recited all present to receive some of it and the deacons carry some to those who are absent those who are well provided for if they wish to do so contribute what each thinks fit this is collected and left with the president so that he can help the orphans and the widows and the sick and all who are in need for any other reason such as prisoners and visitors from abroad in short he provides for all who are in want so on sunday we all come together this is the first day on which god transformed darkness and matter and made the world the day on which christ Jesus our savior rose from the dead for on the day before saturday he was crucified on the third after saturday that is the sunday he appeared to his apostles and disciples 
and taught them the truth which we have put before you for your consideration so this is what st justin the martyr read in the defense of christians in which clearly we see what is the, the liturgy the eucharistic celebration the mass we celebrate every day especially on sundays and the offerings and the distribution of the communion today it has been shrink to only to the to the host that we receive in the body of christ but it is more than that so the early christians they put together everything and they shared and there they felt the presence of jesus the risen lord and in that agape the love they could experience the risen christ in their lives in charity and in love and in sharing and today people lament we are not able to go to church we don't receive communion and all so communion is not really um, really the the host that we receive definitely it is the body of christ but to, at this time as pope said what is more important it is the save the humanity for this humanity only jesus christ came and he died and he rose from the dead in order to save the humanity and bring salvation to all the creatures so this is the time also that god is also teaching something very important the whole world is renewed today somehow the spirit also is working i feel so let us not lament and feel um, embarrassed that we are not able to go to churches we don't receive communion and god speaks so many ways through the word in the bible we have the bible at home today we can read and we can understand god's message each and every day what is the will of god like that and god speaks in so many ways the events in life through history god spoke already this is a time to realize and know what is the plan of god and how we can save this humanity so thank you for your patient listening maybe if you get time you can google it you can find the text this is again i tell this is the first apology of saint justin the martyr in the defense of christians so thank you have a good day god bless you all let us experience the risen lord in our lives at this time of uh, difficulty and this time of uh, quarantine where we are locked inside may the spirit of the lord help us to uh, defend the world thank you god bless you have a good day